everyone and it's lipstick time today so i am going to show you these 12 shades from my stash which are orange lipstick shades and mostly uh, look orange lipstick shades which have reddish kind of hue uh, suits me my complexion i am nc42 indian and i have warm skin tone most of the shades here are uh, are mixed in the sense some are some are oranges some are true orange some have sheer some are sheer orange like that so i hope these 12 shades will help you out in picking and if you like these kind of videos then let me know in the comment section so that i can plan better i can do better and i can just entertain you with better things so hit like guys and subscribe so shall we begin so the first shade is nyx indie flick which is a spot and dupe of mac lady danger both are matte both are highly pigmented both have a color payoff which is quite good but if you are someone who don't like neon orange in their lipstick then you might not like it otherwise somebody who is into bold shade and who can carry them beautifully with a beautiful eyeliner then this is for you if you ask me i have to work a little harder to present this lipstick but i don't mind being this in my stash The next shade is one of my favorite favorite lipstick shade and if you are a MAC lover you might have not missed it. It's MAC Matte Dangerous. It's a beautiful bright red based orange lipstick shade and I have seen many celebrities wearing it and it looks just amazing. It's kind of a must have shade if you are a dusky or a darker skin tone and uh, it's not very bright and it will never wash you out and it is certainly for peeps. Oh my god, well, no, I am not tired yet. This is the lipstick name and it's Sleek Sheen. Oh my god, this is an old shade in my stash, but I really, really like it. It's a reddish orange shade with slight yellow undertones to it and it's creamier and looks beautiful on duskier skin tone. It does look a little patchy, but uh, if you scrub your lips nicely, then it looks great. must be aware of this brand streetwear it is streetwear pink pirouette and uh, this shade is nice it's moisturizing it's not very pigmented and uh, it's not matte and uh, what i like about this shade is that it lifts up my skin tone and it lifts, lifts up uh, my uh, complexion and it looks nice and i like to wear it during the The shade name is L'Oreal Infallible Always Apricot and this one is kind of a shade which will suit a medium skin tone and a fairer skin tone better. It is a orange with kind of an apricot feel to it and uh, this is a shade which you can wear daily as well and you can just layer it up for to get the darker shade for night time as well and uh, it's, it's a nice shade but I don't find it as like a must have or a one of my best shade. Bar orange punch which is a tangy orange shade and it's nice moisturizing everyday shade 
but uh, a pe person who is darker than me it might wash them out for fairer skin tone they can try it out well and this is a beautiful shade on everyday basis you can layer it up and it doesn't have a long staying power and uh, it doesn't have any shimmer it's a matte shade and non drying so it's in the category of shade of orange which i like fuchsia undertones to it and uh, it's a shade which i got because i was kind of you know bored of all the orange shades which i had and if you are someone who like little different shade in their orange then you can try this out it's a shade which is moisturizing and uh, well it will go well with the uh, medium skin tone fair skin tone if you are darker skin tone then you can skip it out Maybelline in love with ginger. This is a absolute gorgeous shade. It is neither too bright red, neither too bright orange. It's just perfect. Only problem is that the staying part is pretty bad. It just stays for like one or two hours and then vanishes off. So you have to keep reapplying it. But it's a gorgeous red shade. I really like it on my skin and I really like it on my complexion. lipstick fireball and i have a kind of a love and hate relationship with this lipstick shade sometimes it looks very flattering and it's a beautiful reddish coral which i think will looks great on all skin tone and sometimes i find it very drying and sometimes i find it find it too sheer but nevertheless it's a choice if you are someone who likes sheer shade of coral and orangish coral then you can try this out this pro long wear alkaline lipsticks have been my favorite since long and uh, these lipsticks are matte but they are creamy uh, on the in the texture and they're not trying the shade look at me is such a gorgeous shade in fact it is the expensive shade in this range and uh, it's a shade which flatters my skin tone beautifully it is a exact coral orange color which is so much in trend and and uh, i absolutely love this shade and will recommend it to anybody who is in the medium skin tone category the next shade is my current favorite that is lacme absolute tangerine touch from the matte range this is a beautiful orangey shade and it just brightens up my complexion it stays for around like 3 to 4 hours and doesn't dry out my lips i like the stain the balm and the texture and everything about this shade it is kind of a must have for me is a beautiful shade of coral orange and it is a shade which is suitable for indian dusky skin tone available in india it's kind of a shade nice to have and if you can buy it when it is on discount and i like that l'oreal keeps coming up with different beautiful coral orange shade now and uh, i recommend this shade A 
Okay, now I am tired of smiling. So if you have come this far in this video, then you are truly a shopaholic and you shouldn't miss subscribing to my channel. So here is the link and don't forget to subscribe and let me know in the comment section what else you would like me to do for you. I love doing things for you. I love making videos and I love writing blogs for you. So do let me know and I'll see you again till then. Bye bye.